Hello there, everybody. I'm Spawn 92 Wiki Nightmare. How would you feel if I told you that, um... Oh, right. <laughs> I just spent like a while... To... At the time I'm recording this, apparently Steam's down the frame rate was really bad. Anyway, we're looking for an administration rig. Sorry, body. And last episode, we took down the Leviathan. So now... Well... We gotta go find a rig. Okay. I was fully expecting an enemy to casually pop up and then just say, hi, howdy, how neighbor, oh. Hi. Are, are you having a good time, good sir? Um, hmm. You okay? You know, now that we have this little barrier between us, I feel like it's a good idea for me to kind of just take this time to have a little bit of a dialogue. Mr. Necromorph, why are you doing what you're doing? Is it because you wish to become whole? Is it because there's some sort of innate desire to where you wish for the creature comforts of humanity itself? Because clearly, there's something about you that's not human in itself. There's a part of you that craves humanity. The reason I say this is because you specifically target people in general. You only ever target the dead people, too. Why is it that you only ever target the dead people? Is it because there is no self in a corpse? That way you can feel what it's like to be a human, even though as you look at yourself in the mirror, your appearance of a human is distorted. It's wrong. It's messed up. And is that why you lash out? Is that why you lash out at other people? Because of the misfortune of the form that you have now taken? Is that it? I know a good doctor I can highly recommend. Mr. Uh, Morph Necro... Should I call you Mr. Morph? Or do you prefer the full name Necromorph? Listen, you don't even have to talk. You can just listen. You don't even you don't even have to take as much of an effort to answer any of my questions. All you have to do is take that step forward. I'm willing to open this door for you. I'm willing to open this door, but you have to be the one to take that first step. To take that first step and realize your full potential. Can you do that for me? Something tells me, I see. You have chosen incorrectly. I gave you the option of peace. I gave you the option of help. And you chose incorrectly. I am truly disappointed. I had hoped you would be better, but unfortunately you were not. It is truly a shame. Okay. I don't know what the fuck I was going on about there. Just, uh, <clears throat> just we're gonna let that slide. Hey, Liz, it's Jacob. Um, I couldn't reach you. If you find this, I'm off deck, but I'll be right back. I got a call from another survivor. He sounded terrified. I'm gonna lock up the SOS speaking and go and get him. Best launch window's not for a while. Anyway, and he sounds like he's worth the risk. He's a doctor. Uh, um, Mercer, I think. About time. We caught a fucking break. I love you. Please, be careful down here. Welcome to the U.S.A. 
Huh. What a bizarre little tool that man had. His corpse is probably going to be up ahead, isn't it? I'm getting my flamethrower ready. Well. <clears throat> Let's move. Yeah, somebody died. Very painfully. Apologies, but it's for your own good. There's something here. I can hear it. Once we go that way, I'll go this way instead. Sorry. Really, I am. I don't take joy in what I'm doing. Okay, there's definitely something here. Anyway, as I was saying, I forgot what the fuck I was saying. Anyway, got that taken care of. Okay, let's just move. Oh, there were some stasis things here I could have grabbed. Hmm. Well, better late than ever. I hear that. Okay. Bitch. Okay. Anyway. Yeesh. Let's 
Say, do I hear any more? Hmm? Any more want to pop out? Hello? All right. Had to make sure. Yeah, we're not gonna talk about that noise that I just heard. Not at all. Nope. Not happening. Not nope. negative. Nope. No. 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 Not at all. Not at all. It's nothing at all. Security request retrieved. Dallas here. Security to the mining deck now. Dr. Kimes lost it. Get back. I know how to use this. Uh, uh, he, he'll live for the rest of his life if you'll give me codes to the cargo bay. Just processing. Why the hell would we have codes for cargo? I must get to the marker. We're running out of time. Give me those codes. Christ, is this what you did to the captain? No, no, Ben was an accident. Don't you dare compare me to someone like Mercer. I'm trying to save you. The markers are only hope. No, right. He's armed. Where the fuck is security? Huh. This door is still having some sort of stasis thing going on. Hmm. Well. Scan rig to unlock workstation. One of these days I'll be able to scan the rig to unlock the work. God, I hate that. Okay. Save my progress and have a good day. All right. The flying fuck was that? You know what? Don't answer that. Oh. Oh, hi. I think what's terrifying is the fact that you have armor. Making you that much harder to kill. I should have paid attention. I wasted so much ammunition. Okay, that worries me. That means I need to pay even more attention to the opponents that I am facing because now they can have... Oh god, they can effectively... Bol oh. Yeah, that is concerning. Okay, they can really... They, they can effectively block my attacks. The more armor they have, the less weak spots that they got. Which means I need to be careful. I may as well keep this equipped. Oh. Well, that bodes well. That definitely bodes well. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where'd you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? You just snuck the fuck up on me, bro! Wait. You didn't... Did he get up from the body that I... Did this motherfucker revive? 
That or just another guy just popped up out of fucking nowhere. Okay. Cool, I guess. As in, opposite of cool. Like, fuck you, bro. Okay, I got like one of these of each in my health, so I think I should be fine for a little bit. I'm not even using the force gun, so I'm going to sell that for some cash. But I will keep enough ammunition for something else later. I'll buy those. Uh, I think I'm going to buy... Yeah, I'm going to buy a power node. I'm going to regret it, but I'm going to buy one. I'm probably going to regret it. Jesus Christ, okay. Level 3 security clearance required. There's a zero gravity area there. Well, uh, I guess I have to go this way in the zero gravity. Sorry. Can't afford to let you get turned. Entering zero gravity. The administrator's rig should be in the processing control room, but someone tripped the failsafe. The control room door can't open till gravity is restored, but the system won't reset the gravity while there's loose debris. At least the processing beam's still running. Stand by. Okay, so I gotta restore gravity, eh? Didn't I see a floating box somewhere? At least I thought I did. Like... Hmm... Man, I've never been good with games that have lighting like this. It really fucks with my eyes. Makes it hard to see. I, this is not a complaint about me. This is literally personal preference. Like, this really fucks with my eyes. I bet you if I stand in that beam, I die instantly. I swear, I thought I saw a box somewhere. Oh! There's a purple thingy. How do I... Oh yeah, the doors are locked because of gravity, so I have to... Okay. Oh, that didn't do the trick. those funky rocks.
You take joy in what you're doing, good sir. Hey! Who did it? Okay. Yeah. That's what you get. I had to do is look around a little bit and then my my question would have been answered. Very nice. Okay. Get out of my way. Get off me. See, this is what happens, I panic and then I freak the fuck out every time. Anyway. Now that those pains in the ass have been dealt with. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's not every day he gets surrounded by necromorphs. Honestly, on a good day, that usually only happens... never. Okay. Anyway! With those out of the way... Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. And fuck you. Okay. Every time I panic, I always end up blasting through a fair amount of my ammunition. Good. Dallas's rig. There. Now I've got level three. Supervisor Dallas. Final log. I've made sure they can't leave this subdeck. But neither can I. I've seen what they do to the bodies. 
what they become. And I cannot let that happen to me. At least if I don't have any limbs. <laughs> and I can't kill anyone when I'm infected. Oh my. Please. Tell Dawn and the kids that I love them. Oh my god! Come on! One more! Oh. Come on, man! Just one more! Dallas! Ah! Oh my god. That dude... I, I can only feel absolute respect for the guy. I mean, I feel horrible, but he knew what would happen if they got to him, and he took one of the he did one of the hardest things to do. He, oh my lord, goddamn Dallas, I. And damn, his, his final message, God bless it. I can't help but feel... I can't help but feel respect for the guy. Okay, that was really well done. I, um, I will happily give you, I will give you that. That was, uh, I will say though, fuck you for doing that. Yeah, I got, it. I got it. I'll check the maintenance sub deck for Temple Speaking. Okay. All right. Okay. Be quiet. 
Be careful. Be cautious. And hope and pray for the best. I got this claw with me. I ain't afraid to use it. Looks like it. What? Is that the marker? That they're talking about? That. Yeah. What the fuck? As soon as we looked at it, like, our signal got disrupted. The fuck is that all about? Well, somebody's dead. Uh... Hey! I didn't panic. You panicked. Am I else getting like weird, uh... Believe me, this is really for your own good. I hate the music. God, I hate... I hate this music. I hate the screams. I hate the sounds they're making.
Oh, yeah. Yeah, I hate this place. I hate this place. I hate this place. I hate this place. I fucking hate everything about this place. I hate it. I hate the noises. Because uh. you want to know what this reminds me of? I hate to make the comparison, but... For anybody that's played Alien Isolation, you know what area this is reminding me of. And it was one of the worst fucking areas I've ever gone through, and I don't want to think back to that place ever again. I know it wants me to go that way, but I want to go this way. Let me check the map real quick. If this is like a single room. It's multiple rooms. Nope. Well. Deep breaths. I got I got razor blades. Okay. Uh huh. Three nine two seven seven. Amelia I must I must return the marker She's right Fuck the church The church wants to doom us all 
Don't believe the lies. Uh, fuck the... Walt... No. And then some sort of alphabet. What the fuck? Jump scare? Hmm, I'll be damned. Well, oh, yeah, that is a uh, not happening on that door. Get off me, get off me. Great. Okay, out of ammunition on both of those weapons because I panicked too badly. Well. I've got ammunition. Ugh. And I got more ammunition. Bitch. Thanks for the med pack. Yeesh. Legitimately, I feel like I'm getting into the belly of the beast and quite literally, even though I already took care of the Leviathan. To be fair, I was putting you out of your misery. You should be grateful. Although, to be fair, you probably don't feel anything at this point, except for unending undead pain. So there's always that. Unfortunately, I cannot help you there. Anyway. Yeah, I hate this. Yeah, no. Anyway.
Nicole? Oh! Oh my god. I can't believe you're here. I thought I'd never see you again. I'm gonna get us home. There's an SOS beacon nearby. We can call for help. The beacon, right. They locked it in the workshop, but my clearance can get us in this way. Okay. Oh god, am I gonna have to protect her? Everyone's counting on us. Okay. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna tear off your limb real quick and die. Really? Are you sure? You see any more? You hide. Okay? Yeah, hide. My heart. I love you, Isaac. You can do this. You'll Good. Put back the way they were. And make us whole again. Okay, um... Yeah, Nicole has lost her fucking mind. That is either not Nicole, or she has legitimately been brainwashed. Make us whole again. I'm sorry. That's the crazy talk. Isaac? Your girlfriend may be at lost. I'm... You're probably not going to be happy to hear that. But... Um... Yeah, uh... Uh... Yeah, your girlfriend's lost. She just did the talking point of the crazy unitologist bastards. Also, I literally can't go back. Okay, fine. There's a purple glowy in there. Oh, that was the SOS beacon I grabbed? Oh, whoops. Launch the SOS beacon, right. More schematics. Oh, it's a minor rig schematic, hell yeah.
Yeah, Isaac, I think your girlfriend, why, yeah, um, uh, your, uh, Miss Nicole, um, uh, she might be crazy cuckoo loco. Nicole's there. We got separated. She'll find her way back. She's a trooper, huh? I'm heading back to the mining control room. I'll launch the beacon. You watch out for Nicole. Assuming the system doesn't fizzle out again. Stay sharp. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Pretty sure Nicole has gone loco. Pretty sure. Sorry. 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 There's gotta be another one of those fuckers down there. Circuit breaker, gondola, zero gravity. Uh, I think I'll keep the gondola. Oh. Something tells me I might need the zero gravity. Yep. I can't proceed without it. Definitely unintended. <sighs> All right. All right. Yeah, we're not going to talk about this body over here. Yeah. We're not going to talk about that at all. But yeah, um... Pretty sure Nicole has gone cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. I guarantee you she has gone cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Good lord, it's a mess down here. No one else is down here. Probably not a lot of good stuff. Seems like a good place. Well, I guess no, no. I I think I do need to stop today. Okay, so good news we found Nicole. Bad news we found Nicole. Unless I'm overthinking this, 
the phrase, make us whole again, is not necessarily the sort of thing that you would say to your partner. At least I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I tell my girlfriend all the time that she completes me, but I'm in the phrasing of this game, the phrase, make us whole, seems a little less romantic and more something to do with the necromorphs in general. In other words, I I think she's actually lost it. I think Nicole is like mentally far gone. So shit is all I can say. But right now I'm stopping. So if you like this, be sure to let me know. I'm uh Yeah, I um uh, mm. This is a problem.